folks Tony here in the middle of the night and I just uploaded or downloaded the new GoPro Hero 4 update which I'm quite excited about and it's like I say it's way early in the morning it's like 1 19 a.m. I've already been asleep for a little while but what I did is the first time with my new uh, 5k Mac that I've used GoPro Studio I've not been real high on GoPro Studio but I saw here when they sent me this that it says that it's best upgradable or more easily upgradable or updatable we'll say uh, by using the GoPro Studio somewhere it said that I'm not gonna uh, you know uh, updating is easy with the GoPro app or GoPro Studio so I went and I, I clicked on uh, you know update where was it I clicked that see how I guess I clicked here and it took me to the GoPro site where I did uh, download GoPro Studio so and I have it here on my Mac now. And so, you know, then I said, well, what do you do? So I'm sitting here going through, well, how, how do you update your GoPro? Well, it, as it turns out, all you do is you just connect the uh, USB to your Mac. I just use one of these, ah, crap, one of these old school USB cores going into the back of the uh, new Mac. And then nothing happens, of course, but you do have to just, just click on the, uh, start button on the front of your of your GoPro and then it takes over and it does the entire thing and uh, it will get to a point where you just follow you follow the uh, the rules and everything here how to get back to where we go and uh, you just follow what it uh, the path it tells you to go through and it'll come to a place where it says there'll be a window pop up over here it'll say updating it'll say done down at the bottom but it is not done so do not click on done <laughs> what you do it will go through five different restarts I believe I counted on my GoPro Hero 4 like five different times it went beep 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 and it, and it uh, sort of like did restarts the whole process took about five minutes I'm quite uh, excited to see um, what the new GoPro Hero 4 software will do very excited about it actually so I'll be doing some test videos with that. I'm talking low because my wife's in bed right now and I'll be waking my wife in the pug up if I talk louder than this. Uh, but anyway, yeah, looks pretty slick. Uh, I've never used the GoPro Studio on a Mac and like I say, I just enjoy editing so much in Premiere Pro that I almost never use the Studio. But there are some advantages or some good things that you can do with this. I'm gonna give it a shot, maybe do some tutorials using the free GoPro Studio on uh, on the Macintosh, the new, uh, like I say, this is the new iMac that is 5K. So look forward to more of that. But yeah, GoPro Studio is a very easy way. You don't have to do a darn thing. You don't have to, to take uh, the cards out anymore. You don't have to record a picture on it or anything. You just make sure, I would make sure that your videos are off there first, that you have everything cleaned off and then just let GoPro Studio do everything else. All you do is plug it up, uh, or first of all, install GoPro Studio, plug up your GoPro, then turn it on, and it goes to town putting the new software on there. Peace to everyone who watches. Hope this helps anyone learning about GoPros.